What exactly is osteoarthritis? Well, osteoarthritis, also called degenerative arthritis, is the most common type of arthritis in the world. It's the type of arthritis that we're all going to eventually get as our joints just start wearing out as we grow older. It's that wear and tear type of arthritis. When we talk about osteoarthritis, we're actually talking about the degeneration of the cartilage at the ends of the bones in the joint. Let me show you what I mean by that. So if you look here, we have two knees. Here's the healthy knee, and here's the one with osteoarthritis. This is your foot femur or your thigh bone, your patella or kneecap, and then the lower bones of your knee leg. If we pull back the knee and look at the cartilage, you can see how this cartilage is nice and smooth, which allows for smooth gliding when you bend your knee. With osteoarthritis, you start have de having degeneration of the cartilage where you lose the cartilage. You may have bone exposure where, you're ha where you'll have bone-on-bone -bone arthritis. You can see bone cysts. You can see new bone formation, which we call osteophytes or bone spurs. This is what an arthritic joint with osteoarthritis looks like. When we're talking about osteoarthritis, there are nine joints that osteoarthritis commonly affects. Let's take a look at those. Osteoarthritis loves to affect the cervical spine or the neck. Osteoarthritis also loves the lumbar spine or low back. It also affects the acromioclavicular joint of the shoulder. Not the true shoulder joint, but the joint on the top of your shoulder where the clavicle or your collarbone meets your shoulder blade or scapula. Osteoarthritis also loves the hip. It also likes to affect the knees. And then if you look at the arth osteoarthritis in the foot, it loves to affect the base of the big toe or the first metatarsophalangeal joint. When we look at osteoarthritis involving the hands, osteoarthritis loves the joints at the ends of your fingers called the distal interphalangeal joints. It loves the joints in the middle of your fingers called the proximal interphalangeal joints. And then it likes to affect the base of the thumb or your first carpometacarpal joint. Osteoarthritis typically doesn't affect the metacarpophalangeal joints or your knuckles or your wrist joints. If you have arthritis or pain in a joint that's not one of these nine joints, and there may be something else contributing to your joint pain, you need to see your doctor about that. Unfortunately, in the year 2025, we do not have any medicines to slow down or stop the progression of osteoarthritis. We just have medicines to treat the symptoms, which are pain and sometimes swelling. Stay tuned for more videos where we talk about the different treatment options for osteoarthritis. I'm Dr. Tom Rainey, board certified rheumatologist. Check out our website, roomthera.com, to see how you can live a better life with less pain with your arthritis.